Rivers and other watery places such as estuaries, lakes and the sea are a vital part of the world around us. They enrich, inspire and sustain us in our lives and we all depend on them every day. These fascinating places, which form an ever-present but often unseen backdrop to our lives, are steeped in our history, they embody our natural heritage, and will play a vital role in the future health and prosperity of every one of us. West Country rivers are home to some of our most spectacular and precious wildlife and form a key part of our rich natural heritage. They are also among the very best places for us to discover, interact with and enjoy the natural world around us. The rivers of the West Country have always been a stronghold for iconic wildlife such as otters, dippers, trout and mayflies. But now, as the health of our rivers and estuaries has begun to improve, many other animals and plants are also returning to our countryside parks and gardens in ever greater numbers. The insect life in our rivers is responding well to reductions in water pollution. The magnificent salmon and sea trout still return each year from the sea to spawn. And even water voles and beavers, which were both extinct in the West Country, have now returned to our rivers once more. People have always been drawn to rivers and their estuaries. We have needed the water they carry to drink, to wash, for growing food and to power our industries. Rivers have always been at the heart of the West Country way of life. Many of our communities, from small fishing villages to our great market towns and cities, are only where they are because of our fundamental need to access or get across water. Throughout the West Country's unparalleled history of trade, mining, political struggles, famous military actions and social reforms, from Roman times to the present day, our rivers have been an ever-present thread running through our communities, our culture and our heritage. For centuries, rivers have inspired our creativity and art. They feature in so much of our painting, writing, poetry, song and photography. Ever increasingly, we've come to realise how wonderful it is to spend time on, in or near a river. They are among our favourite places to walk, run, cycle, swim or paddle and they are so often the backdrop to our fondest memories of days spent fishing, boating, bird watching, riding and so much more. Rivers provide the perfect places to get outdoors, be active and spend some time interacting with nature. In fact, spending time in nature, especially where there is water, is now known to greatly enhance our quality of life. It helps us to enjoy better mental and physical health with less depression, less stress and a greater sense of well-being. The natural world can also help our communities to be stronger, safer, more cohesive and more vibrant places to live, learn and work. Across the West Country, local communities are increasingly recognising the valuable natural and cultural resources that enrich our lives and which make the places where we live so special and rewarding. 
Of course, it comes as no surprise that rivers feature highly on many people's lists, and there is now a growing ambition among many West Country communities to work together in partnership to protect and enhance the rivers and streams running through their local landscapes. Evidence shows that strong community-led partnerships can deliver significant benefits for the people living and working in a landscape. By celebrating, enjoying and conserving our natural heritage together, and by developing a shared vision for the future of the places in which we live, we can dramatically improve the natural world around us, and make our own community stronger, healthier and more resilient in a rapidly changing world. If you love your local river, understand how vital it is to you in your life and share our passion for keeping it healthy for you and your community, then there are many ways for you to get involved. Whether it's helping on a river cleanup day, becoming a river scientist, creating a community rain garden or simply making a donation, working together we can help your river bring water to life for many years and generations to come. <laughs>